Chase reacted with the Blue Futon, a very, very weird Steelbook Tuesday. Angel's Heart was supposed to come in the mail today. It's lost. Don't know where it's supposed to be. So hopefully it's here in a couple of weeks or in a couple of days, and I can show you that. But at Target right now, a lot of their Target exclusive Steelbooks, Target exclusive 4K movies are on clearance for 70% off in stores. So even though 31 isn't the greatest movie ever made by Rob Zombie, it was $4. $4 for a steel book. I'm like, I really can't uh, pass that up. Well, they had Wonder, but it wasn't Wonder 4K. And like I said, any of the 4K, like Frozen 2, Turning Red, The Kingsman, uh, Jungle Book, all those like special 4K packaging, Target exclusives are like on sale for like 10 to $12. But anyway, this is my first time getting a Lionsgate from Target. Let's see how it looks. Okay, it's still the nice little thing where it's, you know, I like that. Kind of just like Best Buy, how it looks that way. So that is pretty cool. And if you look at this, it is still some good coloring. Some blue, some grays, and the nice oranges you have right there. And on the back, we have the car with the lights. Pretty simple. Does it match? Oh, yeah, it does. So this is a solid steel book for $4. I cannot go wrong with this. And then the disc is just one Blu-ray disc. On the interior, it's a bunch of people with wigs. So yeah, uh, it's not the greatest movie, but you can't go wrong with $4 for the Steelbook at all. Bonkers, I had to get it. And like I said, there wasn't a lot this week. Well, actually there was one this week, but don't know where it's at in the mail. Anyway, True Romance. This finally came. This is a special edition uh, True Romance where it comes with the book as well as the Steelbook. So this took a couple weeks to get here as well. Uh, Amazon was delayed. Amazon Prime Day. Did you get anything? Me? I don't really find anything right now. So what do we have for the Arrow release? So looks like we have a nice little book. The OG cover of True Romance. And a lot of nice information from Arrow on this one. A lot of Arrow movies I do enjoy. That does it. Okay, then we also have a poster. We have that side. So it looks like that one. Let's do it this way so you can see it. We have that as well as the other side. Double-sided poster. Dennis Hopper, Val Kilmore, Brad Pitt, Christopher Walken, Gary Oldman. I think uh, Clint Tarantino wrote this or did something. Yeah, Clint Tarantino actually wrote this movie. Anyway, let's look at the steel book. We have Patricia Arquette on this side. Then we have Christian Slater on that side. You can tell the nice little purples, the oranges, really flash on both sides. If we open this bad boy up, Oh, wait a minute. Looks like we get a little sticker. Here we go. Feels like I'm about to sneeze. So it looks like it doesn't match, but it still kind of works because the purple does overlay overall. All right, looks like we have a lot of looks like postcards almost. We have that one. This one looks like a Reservoir Dog one, but it's True Romance. So we just have a bunch of them. We have this one right here. And we have this one right here. And, of course, we have more right here. I wonder why uh, Quentin Tarantino didn't direct this one and Tony Scott decided to do it. I wonder about the backstory. This is the actual postcard, actually, if you ever wanted to use a postcard. And then it looks like you get another mini poster of coming home in a body bag. I think I haven't seen this movie in quite some time, so I need to see what that's actually about. Don't remember that reference at all. So let's look at the discs. We have the 4K disc right here, as well as the normal Blu-ray disc. And the interior is Christian Slater, Patricia Arquette, a still in the phone booth. So those are the two steel books for the week. Like I said, not the ones I was expecting to show you guys, but it is what it is. Sorry, it is a day late. My bad. I have no one to blame but FedEx. Since FedEx, who is the worst carrier in your neighborhood? Is it FedEx, UPS, uh, USPS? Uh, I say FedEx is the most inconsistent, even though they're the nicest drivers in my area. So, you know, there's got to be some pros and cons here and there. So, anyway, Chase Duck with the Blue Food Town. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know anything is Blue Town Topia. You Blue Tonians, thank you for watching. Have a great day. Thank you for watching. Next week is, there is one next week. Or is it, oh, I totally forgot. But I think August 2nd. No, there's a couple next month, actually. I forgot, though. Sorry.